jumping around like a freaking idiot. Whee! founded in the 1980s by a few students in Estonia. Their first game is called Cosmonaut, released in 89, which is a game where you jump around and avoid obstacles in a hovered ship and trying to reach the finish line. Then, four years later, and after they were working on a sound editor, Sky Wars was released, which is pretty much an HD remake of Cosmonaut, though the site says it's a sequel in the histories page, but in the Sky Wars page, it says it's a polished remake. Tell me, is it a remake or a sequel? Make up your goddamn minds! Anyways, Sky Rose. It plays pretty much like Cosmonaut. You use up and down on the arrow keys to accelerate and decelerate respectively, left and right to go, well, left and right, and the space is to jump. There are a few painted blocks that has different effects if you drive over it. Blue refills your fuel and oxygen, light green makes your ship go faster, dark green slows your ship, gray is slippery, and red makes your ship explode. Your objective is to reach to the finish tunnel of a road, and there's a total of 30 roads divided by 10 locations. Some of them are easy, some of them are hard, and then there's a few of them where the gravity is changed drastically. Like the road where the gravity is 100, where you jump really high, or the road where the gravity is 1700, where you can't jump at all. And then there's the road set on Earth, where not only the gravity is 900 so that you jump low, but your accent is decreasing very fast so you have to dive over the blue blocks which reveal your action very often. I can't get past that. The controls feels nice, though if you go too fast, jump and go to a direction, you go all the way to that direction you press. There are no enemies to kill or any opponents to race against, so you only race alone and avoid the obstacles. And if you complete all the roads, if you can actually do it, there doesn't seem to have a reward or something. Nothing. It's pretty much like a time waste, like Flappy Bird. You keep doing it and rage at it, but there's no sense of reward there. Except that Sky Rose has levels that you can actually finish, whereas Flappy World only has one level that never ends, and it's randomly generated. The music is really nice, composed by Alui and Brook. It plays a random song after you select a road, and they sound great. The playlist is a mix of slow and pace and fast paced action. So that was Sky Roads. It's pretty challenging. The controls feel nice, the music is great, the gameplay is pretty hard, but there's no sense of reward after you complete all the roads. I'll give it 4 focuses out of 5. You can get it on their website for free, both the demo and the full game, though you have to run DOSBox if your PC doesn't have DOS in it.